If you ever drive along Highway 138 east of Palmdale, California, you just may notice the ruins of a little piece of history called Llano del Rio. There's not much remaining of the community today, but almost 100 years ago, this small colony was thriving. In 1913, after a losing race as running mate for the Socialist Party's presidential candidate Eugene Debs, and failing twice to win the mayorship of Los Angeles, a man by the name of Job Harriman decided to take his socialist principles out of traditional politics and instead form a sort of proof of concept here in the Antelope Valley. For a while, the colony was very successful, rising in population from five families to about a thousand members in just a few years. Today you can see the remains of the community's hotel, dairy, irrigation ditch, and several other buildings that made Yano almost completely self-sufficient. But by 1917, many problems such as inconsistent water supply, political disagreements, and members being lost to World War I led to many remaining members abandoning Yano del Rio for a new colony in Louisiana, eventually named New Yano. By 1918, Yano del Rio declared bankruptcy and the last remaining residents left the town, which today survives only as ruins.